Hey, it's Three Gnomes, and I'm announcing that I'm doing a game jam that anyone can join. Because we just hit 2,000 subscribers, I'm announcing the 2024 Three Gnomes Game Jam, which is going to be hosted on itch.io, and anyone can participate. I'm so excited to finally hit this milestone. Thank you guys all so much for your support. Let's talk a little bit about how the Game Jam is going to work and what you should be looking for in the future. So first and foremost, you can go to itch.io right now, I'll link in the description, and join the Three Gnomes Game Jam. All the rules are listed there, and you can go ahead and hit Join Jam. It starts on March 8th at 1 p.m., and it runs through March 17th. 2024, obviously, at midnight. I like to think about it like a week and a weekend. So essentially it starts on Friday midday, you have that weekend, you have the rest of that week, and then you have the following weekend as well. And I think that's pretty generous for new game devs to feel like they don't have to rush. There will be a theme that the game has to be based around, and that will be announced at 1 p.m. on March 8th, along with the start of submissions, so that nobody gets a head start on the project. There are a few rules that you have to follow, but they're all pretty common sense and pretty simple. First off, you must submit within the deadline between March 8th at 1 p.m. and March 17th at midnight. Anything submitted after that will not be accepted, and that is central time in America. You must use the theme in some way that I'll provide at the start of the game jam on March 8th. I'm very excited for you to find out what that is and to get going with a, a fresh idea in your mind. Which is why the next rule is you must not submit something that is already an existing project that you created for before the game jam. It has to be created for the game jam itself. You can work on the project alone, there's absolutely nothing wrong with that, that's probably what I would do if I was doing it, but it's also an option to work in teams of no more than six contributors, and I have a Discord, you can join that, and we'll coordinate there to try and help you get teammates if that's the way you'd prefer to go. Next up, especially for new game developers, I want to make sure that you come out of this project with a basic idea of what it's going to be like to create a full game on a micro scale, for when you do it for a bigger project. So your submissions must have some form of start menu to enter the game, a pause menu to return to the start menu, credits to list who worked on the project in some way, and an obvious way to exit the program. Essentially, you have to have a button that allows people to close the game. Pretty simple, but it's not always obvious that those are required. The games must not be excessively NSFW or excessively inappropriate for casual audiences. Essentially, if your game won and it was too inappropriate for me to post on YouTube, that's kind of a bummer. So kind of keep that in mind. What would YouTube not like? Also, AI art is a no-go. I don't want you to use it for the art. I don't want you to use it for the code. I know it's a touchy topic right now, but essentially for a project that's about the art and about learning, I really want people to push themselves to try and make things without AI. Hopefully that's not too controversial. And finally, the finished project must be playable on Windows or on browser. So no matter what engine you want to use, that's fine. You just have to make sure that it's going to be able to be playable by me. And that's pretty much it. Again, it runs between March 8th at 1 p.m. and March 17th at midnight. So a pretty generous window. Make sure you go over to itch.io right now and hit the Join Jam button. I know I've already seen a lot of interest in my Discord for this. And honestly, I'm so excited to see what you guys make. Game Jams have helped me so much in the past. I loved working on the project that I did for... The Game Maker's Toolkit Game Jam, which I'd also recommend. But that one felt a little bit less accessible for new game developers. The window was so tight, I essentially had to quarantine myself in a little bubble, and I'm hoping this one will be more accessible to anyone that wants to participate. So, link in the description, go over and join right now. And again, thank you guys for helping this channel reach 2,000 subscribers. I genuinely cannot believe that in just a couple years I've managed to hit this milestone. So thank you so much, I can't wait to see what you do, and... I never have a sign-off for these things, so go over to HIO. That's, that's a bad one, but I'm going to stop talking.